Hi. This is the new Sony DualShock 3 controller which has been brought in to replace the 6-axis which had the new functionality of the tilt controls but didn't have vibration which upset a lot of people despite Sony saying that uh, vibration was a last gen function they've brought it back. Now, I play a clever trick. It's not DualShock 3, it's 6-axis. And I'm just doing that to be ever so smart and to prove to you I know that's upside down, but 6 x there, DualShock 3 there, just to show you that they are essentially exactly the same at first glance. First of all, the DualShock 3 is notably heavier and sturdier. The 6 axis, a little bit creaky sometimes, the plastic along here and here sometimes gets hairline cracks that don't really affect the controller at all, but people have complained about that, and it's a bit flimsy, sturdier, chunkier, feels weighty, not by much, but it's weightier, the sticks just, I don't know, I don't know if it's because I'm looking for a difference, but the sticks feel better on the DualShock 3, written there, just to prove it. Now one thing I have noticed, for those of you who are really, really, really thorough, on my keyring here I have a little torch. There you go. The PlayStation 3 stuff, if I just shine that through, as you can see, it's ever so slightly... That's messing with the autofocus. It's a bit transparent. You can see there, you can see through it slightly. Not up there, because there's electronics and things inside. But certainly through the uh, wrist... Sorry, the palm rests. You can see that it's kind of a smoky. You can see the torch straight through there. On the DualShock 3, it's proper, ordinary, normal black plastic, not transparent at all. A little detail, but one that you might notice. And apart from that, it functions exactly the same, except it rumbles. It rumbles exactly like um, you would expect. It's not new rumble technology from Immersion. It's exactly the same rumble technology. Um, two weights here on the right and the palm rest and left here. Now this is just opinion, I've not heard a rumour so don't start that one on the internet. I personally wish that they'd have also made it a touch chunkier. I don't really have massive manly butch grrr, fighters hands but I find these too small. If I want my fingers there, my thumbs rather, on the sticks I want that to rest larger in my palm. And I really I, I'm one of the few people who actually liked the boomerang design that was the early concept for this controller. So I would like to have seen this here a little bigger, a little longer maybe, a little wider set so that I can really grab it more like that rather than that. And like I say, I don't have particularly big hands. So there you have it, the DualShock 3. And here's the DualShock 3 rumbling during a lovely game of Tekken. Look at that baby girl.